Hey, some good news tonight. The 23-year-old NICU nursing intern who went missing on a popular Dallas trail two days ago has been located and she is safe. Police say Roxanne Rays have returned home this morning, but they aren't sharing much more than that. Tonight, Aaron Jones spoke to one of Reza's close friends. He's in touch with Roxanne Reza's parents and says still there's a lot of unanswered questions. The details still are, uh, you know, yet to come out. Her family is maintaining that privacy. Uh, so we're, you know, trying to respect the privacy. I'm, I'm sure that with time the family may come out with a little bit more details. Hiram Garcia has known Reza since attending grade school together in El Paso. When he heard she went missing, he immediately jumped into action. Somebody received a last text message from her around 9 o'clock. Uh, and she was never heard from again after that. He says her phone was pinging between 911 location spots 124 and 125 on the SOPAC trail. So that's where he and other friends began their search Friday. We were scouting the area and around, you know, maybe five o'clock in the afternoon yesterday, we located some of her personal belongings uh, out in the trail, kind of off, off on, the, on the side uh, near the bush area. He says that's what triggered DPD's full investigation. This morning, they announced she'd returned home. Again, a lot of these details are still yet to come out, so we're not sure what the exact cause of her disappearance was. But I do know that uh, she was found safe uh, and she was found in good health. As we wait for more details tonight, Garcia tells us Reza's parents want to thank everyone who came out here and searched over the last two days. Uh, they are not from Dallas. They uh, have been in El Paso as long as I've known them. And coming into Dallas, you know, they were greeted with so much support. I'm really glad she's home. In Dallas, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News.